In this video, we're going to be talking about the metal chop saw or metal cutoff saw. We're going to explain to you what types of materials that we cut uh, with this machine and what types of materials we don't want to be cutting with this machine. This machine here is a lot like a woodworking chop saw, except that it has an abrasive wheel to do the cutting rather than a blade with teeth. The types of materials that we are cutting, quite, quite a variety, all of which are steel. So we've got some flat bar here, we've got tubing, square tubing, we've got round tubing that can be cut on here if it's done properly, we've got angle iron that can be cut on the chop saw, and solid stock like a solid round bar, solid square bar. bar. Uh, so there's a variety of materials that you can cut. What we don't want to use this machine for is cutting things that are too thick. So this here is about a half inch thick. That's too thick for this, this machine. It's asking the machine to do too much work and it's going to really heat up your blade quite a lot which can result in some problems like glazing. Uh, we're also not going to be cutting things that are awkward to mount um, or excessively wide. Like this guy here, this piece of sheet metal um, is so wide that it's difficult to mount in there. The uh, jaws of the vise there are gonna have a tough time holding that in place. And also, uh, because it's so wide, there's going to be so much metal contacting that blade, it'll be hard on the motor, and it'll be hard on that blade. You'll be getting lots of heat and potentially bogging that motor down. So that's just too wide. Uh, this guy here, I wouldn't cut on that machine because it's so small and thin that it actually, uh, it would be quicker and you'd have less waste if you were to just cut this by using a shear, something like this here. So you could just technically just shear that off and that's done. There's no real machine set up and you get a nice clean cut without any waste. So I wouldn't bother using that on the chop saw even though you could. And lastly, we don't want to cut any soft metals. So this piece of aluminum cannot be cut on the metal cutoff saw or chop saw. Uh, any kind of brass or bronze, any soft non-ferrous or, or non-iron uh, metals cannot be cut because they present a danger to the user. Uh, and we'll talk more about that in another video. So that shows you all the different types of materials we can cut on this chop saw. In our next video, you're going to be seeing um, the pr protective equipment that is required to use the machine. And we'll also be talking about how to set this machine up and use it safely.